Good afternoon from WKYT News. Bill Bryan and Barbara Bailey reporting. We're right now hitting 1230. The case involving a high-profile bourbon theft returned to court this morning. Today, there were discussions over evidence. And WKYT's Caitlin Sentner shows us what happened during that hearing in our top story here at 1230. Caitlin? It's been some time now since we've talked about Kentucky's largest bourbon heist, but Pappy Gate was back on the Franklin County court docket Friday morning. The attorney for the alleged ringleaders was in court today. Earlier this week, attorney Whitney Lawson filed two motions, one to suppress and another to obtain all Franklin Sheriff's documents regarding a separate investigation into a 2013 Buffalo Trace theft. The State Journal reports the motion to suppress aims to suppress all evidence obtained through two search warrants that led sheriff detectives to five barrels of allegedly stolen wild turkey on the Kurtzinger's property. It goes on to say Lawson's motion argues there wasn't enough probable cause for the initial search warrant. It was an anonymous tipster that led to the discovery of the alleged stolen bourbon barrels and to what's referred to as Pappy Gate. It was an exhaustive investigation that resulted in nine indicted and 100,000 worth of bourbon uncovered. Steroids were another facet. Gilbert and Julie Kurtzinger are believed to be the ringleaders. Gilbert was a longtime employee of Buffalo Trace Distillery. Neither was in court Friday. There was a, a, a prior investigation that happened in regards to another theft that occurred at Buffalo Trace. Uh, there was an extensive, as you heard, investigation that went on with that that we think is related to this. So we've asked for that discovery, um, and as you heard today, the prosecutor is going to get it to us. It's unclear when this case will be back in the courtroom. Attorneys will be responding to motions filed. Live in Franklin County, Caitlin Setner, WKYT. The Kurt Singer's attorney would not comment on the couple's thoughts.